thing. Um, oh, uh, <laughs> sorry. Actually, one thing. I apologize. I apologize. Um, George would like to say a few words um, <laughs> as our Toastmaster. Just, yeah. Thank you very much, George. We really appreciate you being willing to <laughs> do this craziness. Well, I'm, I'm thrilled to, uh, to return to New Zealand again. I uh, first visited there, I believe it was in 1990, for the New Zealand uh, Regional Convention. And I was so impressed that uh, I immediately started saying that uh, New Zealand should have a world con so everybody could see it. Although my idea was to have it in Rotorua, <laughs> <laughs> which has you know more pools of boiling mud and, and geysers than Wellington last time I looked. But Wellington has lots of cool things. <clears throat> they have a, uh, a wonderful museum. And um, they have, just outside it, the Weta Studios, who I hope we can lure down to uh, do some stuff. And of course, Hobbiton is, is uh, you know, close to. And if you go up to Rotorua, you can see the, uh, the pools of boiling mud and the geysers. And you can take a helicopter to the volcanic island, which is good. They have a great lake of sulfuric acid uh, <laughs> where a number of people uh, commit suicide every year, really crazy people. If you want to commit Thanks suicide by jumping in a lake of sulfuric acid. Uh, I did not. Uh, but it was pretty impressive. Uh, so I've returned to New Zealand uh, quite a few times since. Um, I've had a couple lessons in, in uh, doing a haka, uh, which I will have to work into the, the yugo somehow. I, I don't know quite how, but uh, we'll, we'll work on that. Uh, it's an amazing place, and I'm really honored to uh, be part of it. And uh, two years from now, we'll create some new yugo losers <laughs> and uh, celebrate them and uh, let, let everybody in fandom see one of the really the most magical and amazing uh, parts of the world. So Paris and I have loved our trips to New Zealand and we're anxious to add one more to the, to the list. And we have a great lineup of guests and uh, I'm sure everything will run with clockwork precision. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you all. And if there's any questions? Oh. No questions. But a gift. Oh. Whatever you like. I can move. You stay there. Hello, I'm Janie Shea. I am from I am a director of CanSmoffs and we would like to present New Zealand with ten thousand dollars. <laughs> US dollars? Yeah. <laughs> We're Canadian, remember? We'll exchange it now anyway. No. <laughs> the head of finance will take that. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> um, uh, yes. Oh, yes. Sorry. Thank you. I mean, yeah. <laughs> this, this, this is our head of uh, Whispers division as well. Uh, Hello, uh, I am uh, Colette Fazard, and uh, yes, I am uh, very proud to be the uh, uh, WISFIS division head for New Zealand uh, in 2020, or Con Zealand, thank you. And But uh, wearing the uh, ears of power from uh, Worldcon 75, it is my uh, great uh, honor as vice chair from Worldcon 75 to present 12,000 euros in pass along funds to Con Zealand. Anyone else? Got any more money? <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> you know how budgets are. <laughs> uh, if, uh, w we will be um, obviously out at our table selling uh, conversions and so on. Hopefully many of you have already voted and are silver fur and therefore you're automatically members and we can just say hello. Um, we have many t-shirts. Um, uh, we have a limited number of the reveal t-shirts. Please come and buy We also have other, other types as well. I'm like, how long are these rates good for? Uh, the rates are good till the end of the year. Uh, but note the rates are in New Zealand dollars. 
Sorry. When will you start selling? Noon-ish? Uh, uh, about noonish. Um, we just we definitely not before noon. Um, but we just we have to make sure all our ducks are in a row and all our people are actually not going to freak out. <laughs> Any more than they have? Yes. yes. Um, how many people can you fit into a hotel room in Wellington? <laughs> how uh, thinly sliced or cubed? <laughs> <laughs> it would depend on the. Uh, oh. She would like to know how many people can fit into a hotel room. <laughs> Most rooms have a single queen bed in them. However, rooms go up to two bedroom apartment size. So there are a wide range of rooms available and um, you can shop for what it is you're looking for. There are also a lot of service departments available. Airbnb equivalent. Yeah, but yeah uh, service apartment basically equivalent to an Air Airbnb, if you didn't hear that. Norman, that was the raising the yellow fish. Oh, sorry. Do you have, uh, uh, are you accepting credit cards immediately? Yes. Thank you. <laughs> uh, credit card <laughs> transactions are in New Zealand dollars. That's fine. Maybe you back to Coco now. Question privilege, please, for everyone. Um, Omaha is Yes, almost none of the questions are actually making it all the way to the audio that's being recorded. If there's any more, could we get people to wait till the microphone gets to them? Yes, thank you. Um, in the absence of questions, any more questions? I have mine. Oh, oh, okay. Hey. Yes, okay. Uh, Kev Kevin Stanley, but I'm actually not, I mean, the, the um, did you actually, Say at the beginning, the two of you are the co-chairs. I didn't hear, catch that. No, we didn't. So why don't you deal with that first? I have another question. Uh, sorry, for, for Con Zealand, we are having a co-chair structure. I am the chair of fan experience. And I am the chair of business. This is Kelly. Mm -hmm. hey, introduce Kelly yourself. Bueller. There you go. And the other question from your WSFIS area, uh, who is your appointee to the Mark Protection Committee? Uh, for the Mark Protection Committee, we are appointing Daniel Spector. Thank you. <laughs> God go with you. Um, okay. <laughs> Pick one. Is that the correct spelling of his name? Uh, no. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. Uh, if there's an, nothing else, we won't uh, take any more of your time. Thank you. Thank you. Mr. Chairman, you want me to make the motion? I'm going to do it. That oh, yeah. You, you may. <laughs> Mr. Chair, point of privilege. Yeah. Somebody left this on the stage from New Zealand. Please don't leave your clothes behind. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Chairman, I ask unanimous consent that we thank the tellers, I mean the site selection administrators for their work and instruct them to destroy the ballots. Seconded. Second. Any objection? No. Seeing none, so ordered. All right. Do we have someone here from the Irish 2019 World Con Committee to uh, take, make any presentation? <laughs> No leaping. <laughs> Hello, my name is James Bacon. I'm the chair of Dublin 2019 and Irish Worldcon. Uh, we will be, we hope you join us at the closing ceremony because we've had a really nice time here in San Jose and we really want to say uh, thank you, farewell and welcome at the closing ceremony. So please do join us there. Uh, we'll be making some announcements and uh, at that point. We don't have anything else to say at the moment. We're happy to take uh, questions. As I said, I'm the chair. I'm just joined here by Steve Cooper, who's head of facilities, should there be any facilities questions. Um, but we are also available at our table. I'm personally available from 3 o'clock for an hour at our table, should there be any questions you'd like to address to me myself, but happy to take any here. Andrew? Uh, Andrew Adams, can you just remind us about uh, hotel booking openings? <coughs> uh, standard hotel bookings will be the... Stephen Cooper, Head of Facilities. Sorry, I thought that came out. 